you are welcome and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the post notification bell so today i'm going to be doing a self-care um, routine so i'm going to be washing my hair and um, do conditioning and i'm also going to be doing my end of the week skincare routine so yeah if you do want to see that stay tuned i'm going to quickly run some water through my hair and then i'll be back to apply the co-wash so my hair is now wet and i'm going to be using this Anjegi's um co-wash um i really really love this product okay fine so i'm just gonna like put this all over my hair and see if it's enough okay it's not enough i'm going to apply some more like I'm not a hairstylist or anything, this is just how I wash my hair and obviously I don't know the correct techniques to be washing your hair but this is what works for me. The washing is done, so I'm going to rinse my hair and then come back. Okay, so I'm using um, an old t-shirt and I'm going to use this to dry my hair. So I'm just wrapping this around. While I wait for my hair to um, dry down a little bit, I'm going to wash my face. So to wash my face, I'm using this Clinique. Um, it's, what is it called? Liquid Facial Mild. What? Liquid Facial Soap Mild. Yeah. I'm using this facial brush. This is from Clix. It is by Safeway. Okay, I'm gonna rinse my face now. Whew, my skin feels fresh. Now I'm gonna use this Body Shop Liquid Peel. Um, only for good focus. Yeah, I really love this product because I feel like it does remove stuff from my face. Like dead skin from my face. So I'm just gonna use like one pump. Um, let me show you what it looks like. This is what it looks like. So I'm just gonna apply it. Got it to my mouth. So as I start rubbing it in, you'll see that these white things are going to start like rolling up. Yeah. This thing is amazing. I love it. Like after using it, I feel like oh, my skin, my skin feels so good after using this. So I'm just gonna wipe this off with a wet cloth. Done. So I've removed all of that and my skin feels so good. So the conditioner that I'm using is the Dark and Lovely All Natural Not Out Conditioner. So I'm going to apply a whole lot of this, as you can see. So hey guys, I'm now back in my bedroom because I'm here to show you this thing. This is called a hair steamer. Um, I got this from Slick Beauty. Um, by the way, I'm not being paid to do this, but they sent it to me for free. So I wanted to try it out with you guys. So yeah, this is the first time that I'm going to be using it. And because the cut is short, I can't do it while I'm sitting here. I'm going to have my i'm going to have to sit on my bed to do this so i'm gonna also apply a face mask 
So the face mask that I'm using today is the Ganya um, Moisture Balm. Is that what it's called? Yeah. I'm gonna use this Ganya Moisture Balm and um, this is a super hydrating, revitalizing mask. Um, it has hyaluronic acid. I think out of all the masks that I've tried out, this is the one that I love the most. Like as I'm getting older, like I've learned to um, take better care of my skin. Guys, the cut is quite short. Um, I know I look weird, you guys, because of the mask. But anyways, oh, the cut is quite short. It barely reaches up here, so you can't even see the control. But it has got two steps. So I'm going to put it on step one and see how that goes. The inside of the cab is this like shower cab materials sort of thing and then um, the cab is also adjustable so and then this inside cab um, can come out you can just unzip it and then take it out and wash it so yeah I'm going to prop this on my head Ooh, what a while okay I need to get my book on the other side of the bed. I do feel some heat. Guys, it's so weird to talk to you guys with this mask. I looked ridiculous. But anyways, you understand. These are the things that we do for beauty. So I'm going to um, condition my hair and leave the mask for about 15 to 20 minutes. So in the meantime, I'm going to be reading this. Um, this is the book that I showed you guys in my previous vlog. Okay guys, so I'm going to take this off, my hair feels pretty warm, I'm going to wash it first and then take my mask off. So I've just washed my hair, now I'm going to take this mask off, oh, wow. guys just look at my skin, oh my god. Um, I just want to let this air dry a little bit so that the, the serum from the mask can absorb into my skin. So first I'm going to apply um, my eye cream. I'm using the Body Shop um, Vitamin E eye cream. So I'm going to apply my eye cream. Next, I'm going to apply this Neutrogena um, Hydro Boost Serum. I'm just going to use one pump today because um, the because I used the mask and the mask has got a serum and the serum has hyaluronic acid as well. So does the serum that I'm using by Neutrogena. I've been trying out this Herbal Life Skin. Um, I think it's called daily glow moisturizer yeah daily glow moisturizer so I don't exactly know how much like the normal sized one is but I want to find out how much it is because this moisturizer is good and I'm using this Demopal sunscreen it's an SPF 30 a little bit I'm gonna take it down my neck as well. I've taken a shower, so I should be like this girl. <laughs> the last thing that I'm going to use is this Body Sharp Vitamin C. Um, this is actually called a Skin Boost Instant Smoother. But then I like it because um, it's got vitamin C, obviously, and also it has. Um, this shimmer stuff that just makes my skin luminous. Done. That is my skincare done. So now I'm going to move on to my hair. So the first thing that I'm going to use is this um, 
and Jackie's not on my watch. This is a detangler. I really love this product. Dark and lovely all natural. This is an Afro moisturizing butter. coconut oil I've placed it in this container once my shampoo was finished I got this coconut oil from food lovers market it came in a one liter bucket so that is the amount of coconut oil that I use once you warm it up with your hands it becomes liquidy as you can see So now the last product that I'm going to use is this plating pudding um, by Dark and Lovely All Natural. Guys, remember that like natural hair needs a lot of moisture. That's why I use all these products. And anyways, um, like during the week, I don't moisturize my hair all that much. I usually spray my hair with some coconut water from Aunt Jackie's. So I or I use the detangler like during the week that's all I do and then weekend this is when I do this intense moisturizing thing wide tooth comb and I'm going to start at the ends and detangle and then I'm gonna work my way down And I'm also going to use this Denman brush just to make sure that there aren't any knots. So my hair is detangled now. Now I'm going to start the twisting. So I have to ensure that um, this hairstyle does not show like any bumps since I'm lazy to um, make more lines. I have to ensure that I have to ensure that it's flat so yeah I'm just gonna twist like that and then like when I get to the end so just detangle and ensure that the hair is not tangled up in the twist so yeah and then like once I'm done with that then I part another another section so I part another section and I'm trying to do this in like smaller sections so I'm gonna put this hair through here and as I start I'm going to use the the three by three I don't know what they call it. What do you call it? Like the normal braiding method. So I'm using the normal braiding method at in the beginning and then I'm going to then twist. So I do this about two to three times like the normal braiding method. As you can see, I have like three sections here. So then I'm going to take this twisted hair, this one, and then I'm going to put it together with this one. And then I'm going to start like twisting. Ooh, it's really tight. Why did I do that to myself? Okay, it's fine. Again, I detangle. And then I move on. Yeah. 
then this is what I do when I'm lazy to do my own cornrows or actually find somebody to do it but anyways I don't trust anybody with my hair I prefer to do the cornrows myself and the cornrows take quite a while Okay guys, I am done with um, doing my protective hair styling and my skincare is also done. So yeah, that is it for my self-care routine. So I usually do this either Saturdays or Sundays and I do this together. When I do my hair, I do my face as well. So yeah, um, that is it for the video and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you do, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and also don't forget to comment down below. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.